Okay, so... Uh, what are we doing? Oh, I see. It's like, um... Uh, what you call it? Uh, uh um... Sudoku. Okay, so you can't have the same one repeating in the same square. So we got L, we got E, so this will be... This reminds me of that game that's so popular now. Hmm, the late Mr. Adams was ahead of his time. Yeah, see. Um, so then this would be the E. This would be the S. This would be the L. Or dollar sign, euros, pounds, and yen, I believe. Uh, so this is that. And that would be yen, dollars. So no, it's not dollars. It's so this would be the pound. This would be the euro. And this will be yen. All right. Wow. Okay, what does that do? Okay, what is this? Hmm, this one shouldn't be too hard. Are you just turning out all the lights? Are you trying to get to a certain place? Shit, now what? Can't go diagonal. It doesn't let me do anything. Wait, can I jump? Okay, so you can jump as long as it's within sequence. So can I go up to... Okay, you can't do a huge jump. How far can I jump? Can I do a jump of two? No. So you can do a jump of one. So if I go here, here, I can jump up to here, here, over to there, down, jump, 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 over there. Ooh. So I go up and there, and go to here, jump over, jump over, but then I don't have any way back. Okay, that left me three. Alright, we can figure this out, right? These are the easier puzzles. Alright, so let's go down, over, up, over, over, down, uh, over, down, there. there, 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 there. Hmm. Here. No, that's going to leave me one there unless I come this way, which means I got to take out these first. So I'll need. Hmm. Here, 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 here. There, there, over to there, up there, down, down. Damn it, missed one. Wait, what? How did that count that? Okay, that was seriously a game glitch. I missed that one. I should have had to completely redo it, and it let me take it anyway. What the hell? All right. Well, I guess at this point, we have no choice but to do this puzzle. Wait, actually, this is something... Let's check my map here. So I still got one here. I got two in there. One. Okay, that's the one with the key. Just 
Why are the two? Oh, 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 that one. Um, with the laser. Okay, what do we got upstairs? I think this was the phone. This is a piece that's missing. This is the laser. That's where we're missing the wheel. That's where the pool thing. Um, in the basement, we're missing whatever to activate that other one. I really don't want to do this part. Uh, it says there's one here, too. Hmm. Who knows? Am I missing something? Oh! Wait, 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 wait. I know what this is referring to now. Hold on. So there is another puzzle I can do before I have to come back to this. Okay, so let's go back in here. Back in here. Okay, so let's examine this letter again. Thank you for personally taking care of the issue I encountered with one of your safes. I want to congratulate you on your world-renowned locking devices known for their innovation and originality. I am sending you this letter as I am not sure whether I provided you with the necessary information to open it. As you explained to me at the time, the wavelength required to unlock the safe is eight numbers under the upper limit of a buttercup's color. Thank you in advance. Okay. So, the guy sent him a safe that was broken. And that only one in the repair shop that I haven't been able to open, because that one was broken, would be this one. Okay, so we know we can change the color of the laser. So it's orange. So the color of a buttercup is yellow. So we got orange there. Now how do we get to yellow? There's red. Back to orange. Okay, so let me take this up. Blue, yellow, okay. So now we have to find out what the upper limit of yellow is. So when does it become something else? Five, nine, three. What happens if we go to like six? What well, if we go to 600? Okay, so 593, I'm guessing, is the upper limit. Or 592 is the upper limit. Okay, 592 is the upper limit of yellow. So now we got to go down eight numbers. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. When that dials in, it unlocks. Ah. What a clever safe. And there's keys. Ooh. Okay, what are these keys? A T shaped key that'll unlock the other room. A small golden key. Okay, so the T shaped key was this way? No. Where's the T? Back in the main hall, right? Yeah, that's the one right here. Oops. Going on the lock. T-shaped key. Use. All right. We're making progress again. And it's the pump for downstairs. All right. Okay. And what was the other one? The golden key. I was trying to examine it. Uh, well, let me examine it. Where else did I need a key at? Um, oh, 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 uh, the phone thing. What's that? Unless it unlocks one of the doors. Is this one? Yes. Is this right? No. Okay, so it doesn't go to that one. There. Not 
right there. Maybe it unlocks this. No? no. Okay, don't know what that key goes to then. But we do have the pump for downstairs. So, let's go take a look at that. Wait, how do I get downstairs this way? I'm trying to remember where I'm at in this house. There we go, downstairs, this way. Yes, put that, put it there. Alright, now what? Okay, now it'll let me move the water. So, what am I trying to do? Okay, so if you've ever seen Die Hard with a Vengeance, you'll know that they did a similar puzzle to this, where you had to, you had a five-gallon jug and a three-gallon jug, and you had to get exactly two gallons into one of the jugs, or was it? No, they had to get four gallons into one of the jugs between the two jugs. So I'm thinking this is something along those lines. Um, oh, Christ! I just noticed that arrow. So yeah, it needs to be at four. So we gotta get. Between a one, two, three, four, five. So well, between an eight, a five, and a three, we have to get four gallons. Okay, so there's three gallons there. So what we're gonna do is gonna move three here and back that out. I'm gonna move these two. And I'm gonna move five into here. And then we got one space there. Ha! I learned something from a movie after all. Okay, and that turned the water on there. Pumps are going. Alright. Let's see where we can go now. Uh, da -da -da -da. See, there was the dumbwaiter there, but I don't think it would come down. I think this is a separate dumbwaiter from the other one I was looking at. Um, hmm. Okay, what other puzzles do we have? Do, 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 do. Still got that big one, but I'm still missing the key card and a clue to what it could be. Still got that one, which I'll figure out eventually. You know, I just finished showing you guys this tedious puzzle here. I really don't want to give you another tedious puzzle here just yet if there's simpler ones I can figure out. But it may come down to me having to do that one. Um, let's look at the map here. What other puzzles do we have? We have this one in the main room, which I just turned on the water pump, so that should work. That's the one where everything has to equal 15. That's the one in the workshop. Upstairs we have the phone. The lasers, the closet with the missing piece, the missing wheel, the pool room. I don't know what's in that door or that door yet. And all the ones upstairs. So either I have to figure out this 15 point puzzle one, or I have to try and figure out one of these others, which if I'm missing pieces, I can't do. So those two are out. This needs a key, which the other thing doesn't work. I'm missing the card key in that. So the only other one I could really try to figure out is the lasers, but I have a feeling I'm missing something for that. Um, so yeah, I guess our next video is going to be me playing around with this 15 point puzzle thing. Sorry guys, I didn't design the game. I didn't give it all this tediousness. Um, I just playing it. Uh, Oh, I was like, where the hell is that puzzle even at? Alright, so I'm going to call this here because it's been a long session figuring this thing out. And when we come back, we'll tackle this monster here. Um, so yeah, as always, thanks for watching. And we'll see you on the next episode of Safecracker.